I think it's time. Yes, it's time to bring, to bring, to bring history back to life. Cool, it's amazing. Green McCann's TV. <laughs> If you like old movies, then please subscribe to my YouTube channel and don't forget to click the like button to preserve our movie heritage for future generations. Hello, my YouTube hearties. Here's the ultimate boxing match of all time. Who is the greatest silent movie comedian ever? Is it Buster Keaton in the red shorts? Or is it Charlie Chaplin in the blue shorts? Please enter the name of your favourite comedy hero in the comment section. And it's simply a case of whoever gets the most votes is the winner. So get voting right now. Whilst you're making that epic decision, I'll show you my own personal collection of original trade cards featuring both Buster Keaton and Charlie Chaplin during the heyday. These cards were issued with products as diverse as chocolate, tea, soap and cigarettes. Some of these cards are extremely early, being issued just a, a year or two after these movie picture legends started their movie careers. So out of these two timeless comedy geniuses, who are you going to choose as the king of silent comedy? Please leave the name of the best one in the comment section right now. Now that you've seen that video, you might want to check out my hundreds of other silent movie and 1920s culture videos. But here's just a small sample of some of my finest ones. Featuring original relics from the Roaring Twenties. Find out what single event literally triggered the Jazz Age. Also check out one of the first ever rebellious youth movements, the Flappers. See how the rise of the silent movie star helped resurrect fashion trends from ancient glittering civilizations such as ancient Egypt. And have you ever wondered where those feathered headbands and fringe flapper dresses came from? Native Americans. I've also done videos specifically on 1920s hairstyles such as the finger wave, headbands and headpieces and cloche hats and their influence on modern day period dramas. The original artist's impressions and photographic cards that I show in my short condensed videos I've spent years collecting so I hope you enjoy them and thanks for watching.